Hello everyone! Welcome to Pentacool Math Mania. My name is Capsinus123 and today we will be working on division of whole numbers. When we divide, we are sharing or grouping. There are two methods of division, the long method and the short method. Today we are going to look at how to do both methods. In division, there is a dividend, which is a number being divided, and the divisor, which is a number that the dividend is being divided by. The result of the division question is the quotient. In the law method, you show every step of your working which involves a cycle of divide, multiply, take away, then bring down. After the bringing down step, the cycle begins again. Let's do an example. 4,284 divided by 9. 4 divided by 9 is equal to 0. We place a 0 in the answer space on top of question, followed by placing a 0 in the line underneath to be taken away from the 4. 4 take away 0 equal 4. We now bring down the 4 along with the next number in line to be divided, which is 2. We now have 42 divided by 9. We know that we can get 4 9s and 42 with remainders. 9 multiplied by 4 equals 36. 4 goes in our answer space at the top of our question, and 36 goes directly under 42 to be subtracted, which leaves a remainder of 6, and the following number in line to be divided, which is 8, is brought down. So we now have 68 divided by 9. We know that we can get 7 9s and 68 with remainders. 9 multiplied by 7 equals 63. The 7 goes in our answer space at the top of our question. Next, 63 goes on the 68 to do our subtraction where there is a remainder of 5. That 5 is brought down along with the next number in line to be divided which is 4. We now have 54 divided by 9 which gives us 6. The 6 is placed in the answer place at the top, and because there are no remainders, there is nothing left to be divided, so that is the end of our sum. As you can see, we divided, we multiplied, we took away, and we brought down one number at a time. Well done! Now on to short division. As the name says, the steps are shortened, but everything is done in the same place. Example time! 186 divided by 6. 6 can go into 1, so a 0 is placed at the top in the answer space. The 1 is carried over to the next number which makes it 18. It is now 18 divided by 6. There are 3 groups of 6 and 18 with no remainders. 3 is placed at the top in the answer space. And lastly, 6 divided by 6 is 1 with no remainders. 1 goes into our last piece in the answer. 186 divided by 6 is equal to 31. When doing word problems with division, use word statements to figure out what numbers are your dividend, that is the number to be divided, and the divisor, the number that the dividend is being divided by. Look at the question below. Annie spent a total of $3,930 buying marbles that cost $6 each. How many marbles did Annie purchase in total? One marble equals $6. Annie spent $3,930. Marbles Annie purchased equal $3,930 divided by 6. Now, all you have to do is your long or short division to figure out your answer. Well done! Fantastic job on division! Be sure to rewatch the video as many times as you need. Thank you for visiting MathCC today. Try the exercises on Pentacle.com to earn points and win great prizes.